Hello, welcome to this video. In this video, we will learn about how we can make a laughing emoji using Dismos. The graphing calculator. This is fun maths which you don't get to do in school, so make sure to watch the whole video. So we start off with the equation of a circle, which is x minus h whole squared plus y minus k whole squared, which let's say equals 40. Now we'll set up the values for h and k. I will set h 0 for now and move on to k. So if you move the slider up and down, it makes the circle go left and right if you do it for h. For k, it makes it go up and down. So you can set that accordingly. I am just going to do it like 0 0.2 say. And for k, I'll do it 0. Now we need to make some eyes. We will do the general equation of a circle again. So we see x minus the i position, which is 3 and 2. So we do min x minus 3 squared plus y minus. We see the i positions again. So this is this time it's 2. So minus 2. We put a square, which equals, let's say, 1.8. Yep, that's decent enough. Now we can do this for the other eye. We can copy this and paste this here. And all we have to do is change the negative sign into a positive one. So I was just thinking, let's change this 0 0.2 to 0 because it's then in the center. Now let's give this person some eyeballs like that. So we again write the general equation for a circle. We do x plus, let's make it 3 because you see this is 3, squared. Then we put on a plus sign and then we add y minus the value for this one which is 1.5. Then we square it. This should be equal to about 0 0.5. Yeah, I'll put that. And now we can do this to the other side. So we just copy this and paste this in the next one and change the positive sign into a negative one. There we go, we have two eyes. Now we need a nose. For nose, I'll again do circles because we're dealing with circles today. I will put the nose over here. So it will be a zero, so that's why it will be like x plus zero. So I don't need to write this, so I'll just do x squared plus in brackets y. Plus 0 0.4 and a square. This should also equal 0 0.5 because I want the eyeball to be equal to the nose like that. Now we can give him a smile, so we can just use the equation of a parabola, which is y equals x squared. We can make the smile narrower or wider, depending on the number we place in front of x squared. So if we put like a fractional or like a decimal number, it will be... A wider smile, but if we put like two or something, it will be a narrower one. For this one, I should do like um one zero point one eight. Looks good. I'll just do that. Now I want a smile to come down like over there at negative four, so add like a negative four. Now we don't want this whole smile. We want to cut these parts, so we can just put some values in a curly bracket. So we put on a curly bracket and add the values. So we need y to be greater than negative 6. But we also need y to be less than a negative 2. Look at that. 
We've got a smiley face. Looks happy. We can even change colors on this mouse. So you hold on to this color thing. So keep hold on your left key. And then we can choose a color of our choice. I'll choose black. So we have given this person a black outline of his eyes. Now I'll change the border color of his face to black. And give this person a blue eyeball. And I'll give his nose a black outline. And a happy red smile. Actually, I'll fill his eyes with blue. So I'll use the less than or equal to sign. And this makes the eye go blue. Same for the other one. And we've got blue eyes. Now I'll do the same for the nose. So peach nose. So do orange. And change this equal sign into an inequality sign. And so we are done with our smiley face. Now we can add a line here. And like then a tongue. So that would make it look like it's laughing. So the equation of a line will be y equals 2 down from here. So negative 2. Now I'll put the curly brackets on because we don't want the whole thing. So curly bracket, we want y greater than negative 3.333. But we still want it less than positive 3.333. Whoops, the y should be x. Because it's the x values we want to fix, so x. There we go. Now we need a tongue. So for that, I'll use an inverted parabola. The equation for an inverted parabola would be y equals negative x squared rather than a positive one. Now we can make this wider. So let's say um, 0.5, nope, 0.4. Um, okay, how about 0.2? Yeah, that will do. So minus 2 because we want to shift it down. But, oh, minus 3, sorry. And how about negative 1, 0.18 rather than 0.2 like we did before? And change this to 2.5, 2.7. Yep, negative 2.75 is good. Now we don't want it extended, so we put our curly brackets on and set the values. This will be negative 3.375 as it says here, which should be greater than, I mean which should be less than y, and y should be less than some other value, which will be a positive 3.37, and close the brackets. There, we just got a smiley face. We can turn its color to red as well, so that it all looks good. Wow, that looks beautiful. Cute smiley face, laughing one. We can even remove the grid and lines. So we go into settings, remove the grid, remove the x-axis and the y-axis, and we've got this plain one. A lovely mathematical laughing emoji.